All right, good afternoon. A um, little bit north of the old city in Chiang Mai, we're currently looking at this four bedroom home with private pool, uh, five kilometers north of Central Festival. Asking price is about 30,000 US dollars, more than the last house we saw, 6.6 .6 million, so figure 180, 190 some odd thousand. Uh, the property size is 175 square meters, but I'll show you the, the land area is uh, 428 square meters and very bizarre. It's a former uh, Air Force pilot for the US Navy is selling it. I just met him. So anyway, this isn't the main entrance. It's one of the side entrances that comes up into, I don't know what you'd call this room, probably nice balcony out, out here. Kind of a uh, game room, right Katie? Entertainment. Entertainment room. So we're starting in the back street side. So, there's Katie there. So yeah, this would be where Sunday football and all that. So this is all hand carved wood. And they order, to made, made to order. Made to order, yeah. So this is the end of the hallway here, the entertainment room, which is a surprise. I didn't. I thought it'd be a closet. And then again, all carvings in the wood. So this would be a guest bedroom here. Uh, all personal effects are going, uh, obviously, but the pretty much everything, will, furniture-wise, will remain. So that's bedroom one. Again, unique carvings on the doors. Uh, bedroom two here. And a common bathroom. Uh, Golden Gate Bridge. That's the type plane he flew. And then here's the bathroom. Again, kind of unique door. Walk-in shower, uh, western toilet, some sort of Roman thing. Uh, nice sink, elevated counter, the amount of cabinet space is good. And then the guest bat or the main bedroom with the door. Uh, big light. Couch, closets, a lot of cabinet space, and big huge bed, and a big balcony also. So this, this overlooks the koi pond, so this is outside balcony, that's the car parking. That would be the uh, entertainment room. And then down below there, you can see the koi pond. Down there, I'll end up there. So, back out. And we'll head down and show you the kitchen. So that's another entrance to the to main bathroom. All right. And so we're heading down there, downstairs here. Nice woodwork. And oh, there's Chiang Mai. So this is the kitchen area. I filmed upstairs already, so, and we'll, our car's in the back, so I'm gonna go out here first. So this is the main entranceway. So you can see here in this kind of unusual amenity. Waterfalls. 
and the koi. So that's the staircase that went up to the entertainment room. Good side yard. Master bedroom up there. So I'll show you the kitchen now and then the back area, which there's a nice surprise, a couple surprises back there. Oh, by the way, these doors are pretty amazing. Uh, and it has uh, security. Uh, our timing was perfect because we passed the security guard. It looked like about an 85 year old man on a bicycle. Uh, but very, very pleasant. <laughs> so this is the main kitchen. A lot of space. Central Island. Um, TV area. There's a wine cooler. Uh, different cabinets. All the storage cabinets. You know, there's not much pantry area. You notice that? Here, I guess. And then down below. Yeah. And some over here. Oh, another refrigerator. Bottled water, microwave, toaster oven, wine rack. Another refrigerator. Uh, propane. Got a stove. And Central Island area, prep area also. That goes upstairs and then here in another refrigerator side by side here. And then this door goes to a bathroom. First floor bathroom. Nice shower area. Very roomy, very open. And then sliding glass doors out to a little garden area with some breadfruit. Kind of peaceful. I think uh, this would be a perfect area to build an outdoor shower area right here. And the shower area here. And then the only other room, there's storage underneath the staircase there. Then, is it okay if I come in? Sure, sure. Okay. And this would be an office slash possible uh another bedroom possibly uh, primarily an office and the bathroom i was just in connects through that door there i love the woodwork thanks yeah. yes so this is a large large room you, you know what, go ahead you can take me out you know what after i built this i regretted putting this counter in over here okay because right. i find out i spent a lot of time working in here and what I what I was gonna do was cut this down in half and put like mattress pads on there, so right. I'd have a place to sleep. You know, like may, making a big long couch. May I interrupt you? I just want to film the pool area, and then I'd yeah. love I'd love to hear that. Yeah. But and so I'm gonna head into the back. So that's an office slash. I'm not too sure what. And this is the back door here. Goes right out to this absolutely wonderful pool. It literally looks brand new. So the filtration motors are in there. It's all sand filter. That would be the kitchen area. Yeah, the pool's awesome. And, oh, let's get a bathroom here. He built, oh, again, the doors, and kind of a poolside bathroom, shower, Sports Illustrated poster. So here's the weird part now. The pool's a nice amenity, but you've got a little uh, barbecue area out here, some propane burners for some sautéing. 
be a nice bar set up over here, but it comes with its own uh, basketball court now. So you got that little workstation over here. But as you can see, we got a basketball court and the property extends to the back. So here's a second entrance down a cul-de-sac on the back side of the house. Very peaceful and quiet neighborhood. Here's the gate. Get in. But look at the amount of space this place has. It's really unbelievable. And again, the pool. So that's pretty much the house. Uh, north of Chiang Mai. Old city, probably about 10 minutes, 15 minutes to the south of us. Uh, great little uh, neighborhood, a lot of mom and pop stores, very Thai uh, neighborhood, not tourists at all. Okay, over and out.